over 80 colleges in 12 cities with five major cities Mumbai, Delhi, Kolkata, Ahmedabad, Bangalore over 10 million digital reach engaging fashion enthusiasts 500 plus aspiring fashion designers a journey full of effort design creativity dedication 10 finalists mentored by top fashion designers three star designers here's presenting leva prodigy 2016 Ladies and gentlemen, it's the second edition of Leva Protégé 2016. This is a unique platform where we shall showcase the best of budding fashion designers across the subcontinent and make sure that they leave an indelible mark on fashion circuits across the world. Leva Protégé, after its successful launch last year in the year 2015, is now into its second year. It's fueled by the same passion and commitment it took for us to create designers for the burgeoning fashion industry in India. To take us through this vision and the plans that we have is none other than Mr. Rajiv Gopal, the Chief Marketing Officer, Grazim Industries. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in welcoming on stage Mr. Gopal. A loud round of applause, everybody. Thank you, Kobra. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen and a warm welcome to the second edition of Leva Protégé Grand Finale. A special thanks to Ms. Ananya Birla for so graciously agreeing to be a member of the jury panel for the Fashion Talent cost Contest this evening. Ladies and gentlemen, a few years ago, we in the Visco staple fiber business of the Aditya Birla Group had a dream. We wanted to make an audacious attempt at something that had never been tried in the Indian textile industry. With unstinted support, encouragement and direction from our group chairman and the hard work put in by our teams, we saw almost exactly two years ago to the date in March 2015, the birth of Leva and have introduced our own young fashion design talent hunt, the Leva Protégé. This is in line with our group philosophy of nurturing and promoting young talent. It is a unique property through which we not only associate with young designers and fashion institutes, but also get a chance to introduce Leva to them at a very early stage in their career. This year, the contest started in October 2016, and after multiple elimination rounds over the last few months, only the best 10 participants have been shortlisted for today's final. They have used Leva fabric to bring to life their imagination and creative instincts, and we are sure to be treated to a delightful range of collections by these talented young designers. These finalists have also been mentored by some of the leading designers who will be introduced to you shortly, and I thank each and every one of them for their commitment, time, and passion for the cause. So let me not take much more of your time and once again warmly welcome you and invite you to enjoy this special evening. Thank you. So, well, as you can see, this has been absolutely fantastic, isn't it? So, well, ladies and gentlemen, this year has taken in a lot of account, account for a lot of color, a lot of edgy fashion ideas, and of course, some great prodigies backstage. But, well, it would not have been easy for them without the mentors who played a very important role. So, ladies and gentlemen, our first mentors for this evening, Dave and Neil. to see you guys well next applaud and welcome on stage our next mentors Shivan and Naresh Hi, How are you doing? joining us from our next city is Ahmedabad and yes Ahmedabad is represented by Anuj Sharma ladies and gentlemen please welcome Anuj mentor is Nachiket Barve. He is the regional winner of International Woolmark Prize this year and has won many more awards for costume design last year. So well, please welcome Nachiket. <laughs> Well, 
well, well, it's just the geography that is going south and it's time for us to welcome our next mentor who hails from Bangalore. Ladies and gentlemen, Shanak. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for us to take a look at the distinguished people in whose hands the fate of our protégés lie. It's time for us to welcome our jury member, Ananya Birla. Narendra Ahmad Kumar. The gorgeous Malaika Arora. Vikram Bhava. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I know you are excited to see what our finalists have worked so very hard towards. So without further ado, I'm going to leave them to wow you as we start our first segment of the fashion show. So ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for India's first all vocal ensemble, Voktronica. Now ladies and gentlemen, it's time for us to move to our second segment of the fashion show. Hi, Jury. Did our prodigies meet your expectations? I loved it. It was absolutely wonderful. For all of you all, you really inspired me. Um, and uh, all the very best for the future. I'm sure all of you all will make it big uh, if you all continue to work hard. And, uh, but I hope the best for everyone. Fantastic. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for us to invite on stage Mr. Dilip Gore to kindly say a few words. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Gore. 
Yet again, Liva Prodigy has set the tone for how we continue to look for the very best talent across the country. For us, Liva Prodigy is not just about fashion talent hunt. It's about our commitment to promoting the Design in India concept, which I believe is the key to laying the foundation for the success of Honorable Prime Minister's Make in India initiative for textile industry. I believe it is a designing talent which will make a difference for India vis-a-vis low-cost producing me too producers in the world and set the stage for our global dominance in this sector. It is our intent to accord these young designers with best mentorship and guidance to help them secure their rightful place under sun. So ladies and gentlemen, are you excited to hear who our top three winners are? Winners our second runners-up for the evening at Leva Protege is Kitki Talewalkar from NIFT Bangalore. Whew, all right, ladies and gentlemen, the first runners up at Leva Protege is from Amchi Mumbai, from BD Somani, Prachi Bafna. And now, ladies and gentlemen, for the winner who takes home 200,000 rupees. The winner who takes it all. NID Ahmedabad, Parul Suta. So standing next to me is the winner of Leva Prodigy 2016. Parul, congratulations. Thank you so much. So how does it feel like to finally win this title? It feels amazing. You know, like I've done a lot of hard work and it always pays off. So it's like that. First runner up of Leva Prodigy 2016 is with me. Prachi, congratulations. How does it feel? It feels amazing, amazing. It has been an amazing journey. I've learned so much. And this feels amazing. It's been like 15 years of studying and this is my first trophy, so it feels amazing. Hi Ketki, congratulations on winning the second runner-up title for Leva Prodigy 2016. How does it feel? I feel thrilled. I'm so excited to be here and share a platform with such renowned guests. Nice. Feels good. So I have here with me the top three winners of Leva Prodigy 2016, Parul, Prachi and Ketki. And what's even more fascinating is that these are three stunning women. So all for girl power girls, congratulations. What do you guys, what do you girls have to say? A message you want to give out to the world. Why should, Why should boys, boys have, have all the fun? fun? <laughs>